The COVID-19 pandemic forced the Washington International Horse Show out of the DMV this year, but that didn't stop dozens of championship hopefuls from making the trip to North Carolina to compete, and that includes Virginia native Riley Hogan. No escaping. I think I did my first horse show when I was three years old. My, both my parents rode, uh, my grandparents, pretty much my whole family, so I was kind of born into it. Born into it on her family's farm in Warrington, Virginia. Riley Hogan is 18 years old and competing this week at the Washington International Horse Show at the Tryon International Equestrian Center in Mill Spring, North Carolina. It's a lot of excitement, especially when you're at the big horse shows like these. Like these are the horse shows that we worked all year building up to. Riding is the center of Riley's world, and it was made a little easier by the COVID-19 pandemic. With her school, Liberty High in Bealton, Virginia, going virtual her senior year, she was able to continue training for shows while taking classes, sometimes both at the same time. I was sometimes on the horse during the Zoom call, but I had all my work done. I mean, I graduated with uh, all A's. With her eye on the prize, this week she's competing in the Children's Jumper Championship and the WIHS Equitation Finals, which judges the rider's ability, not the horse's. It's how you work together. It's your relationship with the horse. There's a lot of factors that go into it, which sometimes can be the hard thing. It has to be your day. It has to be the horse's day. It really comes down to having luck on the day. Luck may help her this weekend, but it's her talent that's earned her a spot on Oklahoma State University's equestrian team starting in January. Reporting from North Carolina, Charlotte McBride, WUSA 9.